Hello, in this video we're gonna make image gallery with Vue.js. The purpose of this exercise is to practice. Because you can't learn anything without practicing. I'm gonna explain to you what I did to make this gallery. Try to make it by yourself before watching the solution. Like you see, we can change image with the mouse hover. The active image has a border. In data, I create an array for images paths. I used the directive v4 to show these images. I added a mouse over event to images. I used the directive v bind class to add border to the active image. I'm gonna show you a trick that may help you to add a border to the active image. In Vue.js, we can write a condition between double curly braces. For example, if the number of likes is greater than zero, I'm gonna show the message good car. Else, I'm gonna show the message bad car. The two point means else. Like you see on screen, when the number of likes is greater than zero, the message changes from bad car to good car. We can use this condition with the vbind class. I'm gonna bind the class. I'm gonna show you how to write condition. If number of likes greater than zero, return true. That means add the class to the element. Else, false. That means if number of likes is less or equal to zero, remove the class. Like you see, if the number of likes is greater than zero, there is a background. Now I'm gonna show you the solution, but it's better if you try it by yourself before watching the solution. First, I'm gonna create a div for a view app. In script section, I'm gonna create an object that contains data. The data in Vue.js 3 is a function that returns an object. I'm gonna add an array to this data. I'm gonna call it pictures. It contains images paths. Next, I'm gonna create a view app and I'm gonna mount it to the HTML div. I'm gonna need two divs, one for the active image. I'm gonna give it a class picture. The second div for all images, I'm gonna give it a class pictures. I'm gonna add an image to the first div. I'm gonna bind SRC with Vue.js data. I'm gonna show the first picture in the list. It didn't work. In data, I wrote equal instead of two points. Now it works. In the second div, I'm gonna add all pictures.
I'm gonna use the directive v4 to show them v4 picture in pictures I'm gonna add the variable picture to SRC In style section, I'm gonna change the sizes of images. I'm gonna set the width of the class picture 800 pixels. You can use another width, it depends on uh, your screen. I'm gonna set the width of the image of div picture 100%. I'm gonna change the width to 900. I'm gonna resize the other pictures. I'm gonna use display flex to show images in the same line. I'm gonna change the width to 150 pixels so all images have the same size. I'm gonna add a margin between images. I want to add an event to change the main image. I'm gonna add a variable to data for the active image. I'm gonna change the name of the variable. I don't want to confuse you. Let's call it active picture. I'm gonna add methods to the object view slider. I'm gonna call the method change active picture. It took as parameter index. It will change the value of the active image to a value of a selected image. I'm gonna add an event at mouse over to images. At mouse over change active picture. I'm gonna add the variable index to v4. Like you see now at mouse over the image change. It remains to add a border to the active image. In style section I'm gonna create a class active. Border, 4 pixels, solid and uh, color. I'm gonna add the class active to all pictures. I'm gonna add a new variable to data. I need this variable to know the index of the active image. When we load the page for the first time, the active image is the image with index 0. I'm gonna bind the class active and I'm gonna use a condition if index equal the index of the active image true that means add this class to the picture else false don't add this class to the picture now only the picture with index 0 
has a border. But when I change the image, the border remain in first image and the active image don't have a border. So I'm going to change the value of the index of active image. I'm going to add this line of code to the method change active picture. The new value of index of active is the value of index of the selected picture. Now only the selected picture or the active picture has a border. So this is how to make images gallery with VUGS. I used two variables, one array, one method, and five directives. If you make it by yourself, share a link to your images gallery in comment section. This is the end of this video. Take care.